Hi guys, let's learn round function which is coming under the math and trigonometry, right? Take an example, here you are having the data, the data generally, the round formula you are going to use. You wanted to show any data which has got more than 0.5. Take an example, 55.66. Generally, 0.66 is more than 0.5. So you wanted to show over here that is 56. If any data you have that point less than 0.50. Take an example 79.10. You wanted to show here 79. For that you are going to use use the round formula. So the formula would be equal to round bracket start, then the data you have you are having, then comma, then zero. Because after that you don't want any decimals. Then close enter. See. Let me drag this one. Okay. Just because it is 55.66, 0.66 is more than 0 0.50. For that it says 56. You can take another example, just because it is 79.10, 0 0.10 is less than 0 0.50. So for that it says 79. Okay. Let me show you another example of round up. Roundup will always show the highest value. Take an example 55.66, it will show 56. If it is 80.12, it would be so 81, right? Because you have written up. Now you are give, giving the range, then comma, then zero, then bracket, enter. Let me drag and show you. So you can have a look. See here it is 91.33 but it shows 92 because round up, up always taking or pushing forward the data. So like this round down is there. Again the same thing. Data, comma zero, close bracket, enter and drag this one. Right? Here, just because it is 55.66, it will show 55. If it is 80.12, it would be so 80. Right? It will drag one value behind. Though you are having the number 116.73, but it show you the down value that is 116. Right? In this way, it works. Thank you very much. See you in the next lecture.